Hello, and thanks for using JamStudio.com's Jam Recorder. My name's Jumper, and in this tutorial, I'll briefly walk you through how to get started making music with this new tool from the Online Music Factory. Jam Recorder is a simple 8-track digital recorder that allows you to lay down your own music quickly and easily with zero latency. Jam Recorder is the first of its kind. It does not require intense knowledge of audio production or music, and can be easily used by just about anyone. Jam Recorder has many features you'd expect from a digital recorder. You can adjust volumes and mute each track, record on any track, name each track, import a file to any track, and export to a file, not to mention saving, opening, and creating new Jam Recorder files. Jam Recorder's interface is similar to that of jamstudio.com, making it easier to use the two together. Okay, so let's get started. In Jam Recorder, arm the first track by clicking the record button. Click play to begin recording the first part. I'll begin with the rhythm guitar. Okay, now let's listen to that and check the levels. That's not bad. Now let's add a solo guitar part. You can record on one track while listening to another track, but be sure to plug in your headphones to avoid the record loop created by your computer speakers into the microphone. And to avoid confusion in the future, let's go ahead and name these tracks before we record. Okay, let's record the solo guitar part now. Okay, let's listen to that one and check its levels. And it's as easy as that. In just a few minutes, we began recording two tracks to our song. But let's save the project so we can come back to finish it later. Jam Recorder reads JAM project file types and defaults to the Jam Recorder folder for opening and saving, but you can save your project anywhere. Well, that about wraps up the Jam Recorder overview for now. Enjoy making music! This entire video was recorded with this microphone that I got free with a computer I bought more than six years ago.